hello guys welcome back to sedex Tree. and for today's video i want us to look at these five best tips that if you try on your rabbit he will perform well or these five tips that will help your male rabbit to perform well so if you want to know how stay tuned so as you can see i'm here at the backyard i'm about to feed the rabbits it's seven o'clock in the morning and i have to feed them so i'll be making this video as well as feeding them so that you can get what I'm trying to say. So if anybody of you or your friends wants to start rabbitry, here's the channel you can start with and in a small venture, this is the channel you can start with. So you can share with your friends, like and subscribe to the channel so that you can improve as well. So first of all, you know that male rabbits are really, really important to us farmers because they are the one who breed for us to get our money. So if they are not treated well, then they cannot breed and these five tips can help you to improve your male rabbit for him to breed well and as you guys know it can get to a time a male rabbit will be tired of breeding you have to just call it and get a new back for you to be able to get a new back or really really performing back you need to take these tips seriously you shouldn't make your male rabbit pass through these things or else he will end up being a dull rabbit inactive and not breeding as well and if you don't want your male rabbit to be doing all the stuff you need to take all these things into consideration now the first thing we have to talk about is the time of breeding the time of breeding which is really, really important in rabbit farming now when sun rises the weather becomes hot and with that times you cannot breed your rabbit so the appropriate time for you to breed your rabbit is at dawn and at night which means that time the weather is very very warm and it can fertilize the semen and makes breeding successful but in hot times you cannot breed your rabbit it's very 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 dangerous and then number two tip i want us to talk about is lifting for your rabbit when breeding now it may it may seem like an advantage because it will help the male rabbit to breed well yes it will breed well but it's not necessary all right he is a male rabbit he can do his job and he he doesn't need you to lift the uh, female rabbit for him so when you do that the male rabbit becomes dull he, he's like okay so whenever whenever he wants to breed you are there for him you'll be lifting the dough for him so when you place the dough inside his cage he will not be active to breed her so whenever you want to breed your rabbit do not be lifting for your male rabbit or else he will not breed her all right so that's number two tip which can make your rabbit inactive or not to perform well which is very very uh disturbing because when you see your rabbits not breeding you you will, not, you will be worried you'll be worried so you don't have to be lifting for your rabbit whenever is breeding and then number two number two tip is remember to get your male rabbit from a good source now when I talk about good source when you go to a farmer you want to get a male rabbit to buy you should look at the offspring you should look at the father if possible you should look at the grandparent too if they are performing well or if they are performing back then that kid or that male you bought will be a very very good bag but when you get a rabbit from a bad source which has a very poor background then you are going to face that consequences all right because he will not be mating if his father is not performing how would you want him to be also performing so he will just take the lead of his father and not to breed for you so when you are getting your bag for breeding you have to be very very careful with that or else you are going to run a lost and you just have to just uh, kill it and get a new rabbit and the fourth tip is do not overfeed your male rabbit now it might sound a little bit awkward because some will say why should I feed my rabbit yeah you have to feed your rabbit but do not overfeed all right do not overfeed because when you overfeed your rabbit he will gain excessive weight in his body which will make him less in breeding less active in breeding because when male rabbits have 
this excess uh, fat in them it, it makes them dull not to be active like the way the other bags are doing every time because they have this more or uh, overweight in them which makes them less active in breeding so if you want to have a, a good back or performing back you should notice that you don't have to overfeed them all right so if you give your meal rabbit one cup of feed or one cup of pellet a day it will be okay but not in a case that you will give him the feed in the afternoon in the morning and at night which will cause him to build this excessive weight in him and that might cause your loss when it comes to the meals all right i know that they are the ones they are the champions of the farm they are the ones who will be breeding for you to be having your income which is the kids so if anything happens to them you should know that you have to you have to take it serious you know so when it comes to male rabbits they are really really important to us i'm not going to lie they are really, really important i know the females too play their role but i think the males the males are the main champions of the farm you know and the last tip i want to give is that you should breed your rabbits with, with an experienced dough now what i mean is that you know when you first get a male rabbit you you want him to perform well you know so you don't have to bring him a new female a female that hasn't been uh, bred yet you know so that you can have that experience from her you should get an older doe the one that she has been bred like two times three times with that she knows all the you know she knows all the styles so when you get your new breeder for her she can handle him not like you have a new meal to uh, start with your breeding and you go and get a new doe to it can it can't work it can't work they are not they the two of them are not experienced if they are two new breeders they are not experienced so they won't have that energy to start with but if you get an experienced doe with a new back yeah he will perform he will try his best and she will try her best to get him to get it so that's it you just have to get an experienced doe you just have to breed your rabbit at the right time which is at night and at dawn you don't have to overfeed your rabbit and also you should get your back from a good breeding stock all right so if the father is macho you know the kids too will be champion so that they can perform on your farm for you so i'm still feeding them right here and you know i have to just clean up this place before i give them their drinkers so that's it and i hope this video was very very helpful to you guys i know by this time if you are watching this video you've learned so much when it comes to how male perform when it comes to breeding and how important they are to us so you shouldn't hesitate to share this video to all your friends who are into rabbitry or who are now starting their rabbit it can be really really helpful to them as well because you know if you are a, a new uh, rabbit farmer you should know a lot a lot a lot of, uh, of them so if you know a lot about them you you will not be uh, going around looking for other people to just be checking your rabbit when it comes to breeding you're going to look for a person to come and check if they are on heat period for you to breed them and also how to know if your rabbit is pregnant you'll be going out looking for people while you can learn all this here on this channel and get in touch with it just be perfect perfect on both sides which will help you very very well now i'm giving them their waters and i hope this video was very very helpful all right if you go without subscribing i have a problem with you seriously i have a problem with you so make sure you subscribe and I'll touch you in the next one.